If hopefully you guys will, will get some good info out of all of this. Um, my lectures are sort of set for physician level, so I've, I've tried to kind of make them a little bit more basic, but if it gets too complicated, let me know. And then, of course, I guess this afternoon we're doing the full, full liquid uh, face injections on a couple of patients so everybody can see what that, what that entails. And then tomorrow, I think everybody gets to do their own. All right, so why don't I start off by having you mark out where we're going to be injecting, because that's, you know what happens when you actually have to think about where to put the dots, all of a sudden it's, oh my gosh, now what do I do? So that's why I'm kind of focusing here on doing that. It's the hardest part. The injections themselves are very easy. Erase it, do it again. Consider where your injection point is going to be. Consider how big your needle is. Consider how many injections you want to do, and roughly how much you're going to put in that hole, and how much product you have left. Lips, different story. Lips is all about symmetry. If you get the lips symmetrical, you're not going to go wrong. So what I do with the lips is I'm going to mark my central point. I'm going to tell the patient, open your mouth and then close it really soft. Perfect. When she does that, I can I can find the center of her lip. And the center of her lip is usually going to be right along the frenulum. And you can see her is a little off center, but it doesn't matter. My central point will be right here anyway. Mm -hmm. I'm going right down the middle. This is my center. <coughs> Lower lip, same thing. That's my center. So what I'm trying to do by injecting here is I am trying to weaken this muscle that pulls the corner of the lip down. And if I can weaken that a little bit, then what you'll see is the lip comes back up a little bit. Okay? And it's a very nice way of raising the corner of the lip a little, and people really like that. Okay? So let's put, put your mark back up there. Awesome. Okay. So you want to do one injection? Okay. I would do one injection. One. Remember, the less injection in the eye, the less chance of you bruising her. And that's my biggest, most, that's, that's the biggest thing I have. If you want, if you want, I can put, put the syringe in there, what, the location-wise, then, then you can put your hand on it and then do you do the injection. Just so I can get, get you where, where I want it so you can see what the tenting feels like. Unless you want to go at it, go for it. It's all you. Feel free to go deep. Do not fear. The worst thing that happens is you're going to touch her bone. That's the only thing that happens. Okay? And I'll make sure your mom doesn't move around. <laughs> you get comfortable. Go deep. Deeper. Now let's go ahead and put our needle in here and, and, and move it up to the top and then be injecting as you withdraw. That actually looked a little bit better. Mm -hmm. I think you still got a bit more of it in one location, but that's okay. Look mm -hmm. around the angle. So go vertical. Go down great. to where you feel the bone. And now just inject about... Oh, but you want to be on the bone. On the bone, the whole injection. Mm -hmm. The whole thing? Okay, stop. Now you can pull it out. That's fine. Stop. Okay. And now, rub it around with your finger a little bit. You see that? Mm -hmm. Now feel it over here compared to over here. See what a nice job that is? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then I'm going to have you pinch up the corner of the lip. Mm -hmm. And we showed you yesterday how to put some in the corner of the lip. We'll do that again today. So cor hold on one second here. Corners of lips are kind of hard. Some people you can pinch them and get them where you want. What Dr. Abershami does, I think I'm going to have you use his technique, is going from the side and just go right under the skin at the corner of the mouth. <clears throat> That's fine. And this is where you want to inject is right here, where my Q-tip is. So next time, <clears throat> I'm going to have you put the needle in here, but just bring your needle all the way up to where this area is here, yeah. right about there. Okay, and see, that's how superficial you need to be. Okay, mm -hmm. and let's just go ahead and inject a little bit. Good. And you're getting a much better feel for it now. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's exactly what you want to do. Okay. And